Hello my gorgeous people, these are all my thoughts and opinions based on information in the public domain. Please do your own research and this is for entertainment purposes only. First of all, I want to thank everybody for supporting, for coming to our platform that's still here. Because <laughs> given how things are being cancelled right, left and center. So thank you for watching the video number two thanks for the donations for the school thank you to all of you um, i'm really looking forward to one particular person who's going to come and want to help out with the school which is really great um, for those who keep asking me how to help it's in, in the description the video and the paypal account is mu much appreciated um, I am really struggling with the weather. <laughs> I can't wish I could tell you that I'm not, but I, it, 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 it's really a struggle. The heat, and I, I got to the worst, and I got to Nicaragua in the hottest month there is, which is April. Hopefully May is coming soon. Anyways, what we came here for. Megan's podcast. Now she's trying to pat, patent the word ar archetypes. That's a word that's been in the dictionary. Uh, she didn't make it up. Uh, nothing. I mean, it's just another ploy to attract attention. Um, you cannot patent a word that's in the dictionary that's common use. You can only patent things you invent. Um, or your pro she can patent her own name, Meghan Markle, you know. She cannot patent the Duchess of Sussex because as a title that doesn't belong to her. She gets to use it. But I mean, she can go as far as try to patent that just in case they take it away from her or from Harry. Now, the reason why I think she's doing this is because she wants to delay the podcast. I think this is a ploy of hers to delay the podcast saying, oh, well, I don't want to get it started until I patent this. And if the patent is denied, she already has had her patent denied, I think, in the Philippines by this very nice bloke who had Archwell for the longest time. So she couldn't patent it worldwide. To me, and I, I could be wrong, this is a ploy to complicate things because she hasn't been able to secure guests that she said she would because she's toxic. Um, I heard that she's trying to get Oprah to pay back the favor that she gave Oprah by gracing her with the presence and that live fest of whatever. That's not an interview. It was a live fest. So she's been trying to call in favors from Serena Williams, Oprah Winfrey, and even Franca Chopra to be women to appear in her thing. But apparently it's a no-go. Or do you think they're going to show up? Or do you think Michelle Obama is going to show up? I'm telling you, she should get Hilaria, Hillary Baldwin, um, Jada Pinkett, Leah Thomas, and her. And they can talk about labels. They're all, well, you know, at least three of them are social climbers, are absolute narcissists. And I think Leah Thomas is a crazy one. She wants to talk labels, she could have her sister Samantha, but I mean, what do you guys think? I really do think that this latest thing of trying to trademark a word that's already included in the dictionary is just a way to delay and say, well, I don't want to get started because if I don't get this trademark, then I can't do the show. I, I mean, this woman, it's, 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 you know what's the worst part of it all? She's doing this using the name the Duchess of Sussex. Many people have said that, oh, you know, the Duchess of York, she, at least she earned a living when she, when she dug herself into a lot of debt. Yes, but how did she earn that living? She fleeced the hell out of the Duchess of York title because that was the only thing that was the only reason why she was getting hired or those deals she also went on oprah and i urge you to please look at her interview where she trashed and demeaned you know 
denigrated. Even the customs that the queen, you know, was frugal in, in the matter of, you know, electricity and stuff like that. She talked about very intimate stuff. This is why Princess Diana quit talking to her because she, she even talked about, I think it was bunions or something that Princess Diana had. I mean, there's no boundaries with the Duchess of York. So I know there's a lot of people defending her because, oh, she worked. She worked why? Why was she hired and why? Because of the title, which is exactly the same thing Meghan Markle is doing. Exactly the same thing. She didn't go as uh, Sarah Ferguson. No, it was the Duchess of York for presenting White Watchers, who it was, which was owned by Oprah. I mean, if you look at it, the common denominator in everything is Oprah, who's very good friends, by the way, with Eugenie and, and, and Beatrice. So, so, yeah, it's true. I mean, Sarah is involved in all kinds of shady deals. And the same thing goes for Meghan Markle. Why do you think Meghan Markle is getting any of the deals that she's gotten right now? Because she's talented? Do you think? Of course not. It's because the Duchess of Sussex title. And she makes sure that the Duchess of Sussex title is mentioned everywhere. It's not Meghan Markle. It's the Duchess of Meghan. I am Meghan. Because now she's only a one name like Madonna, Adele. But I mean, I could be off the pot here. But this is what I really think about it. And, you know, another question. It's going to be interesting to see if Oprah pays her back for the, and appears in her podcast, if she ever makes one. Because I'm pretty sure that the patent for art, 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 archetypes is going to be denied because it's not something that's original. It's not something that she invented. So, therefore, she's going to be putting that on hold until she can, I don't know, why doesn't she trademark her own name, Meghan Markle? What's wrong with that? Other than she doesn't want to be Meghan Markle. She doesn't like herself. She likes the Duchess of Sussex. And in regards to them and the press giving them a free pass on everything, I think it's about time everybody stopped giving them a free pass on everything. Meghan Markle should be called by the right labels. She wants to talk labels? I have a few for her. Fraud, liar abuser um let me see uh, narcissist i mean the list goes on and on sorry about the dog the list is endless so if you want to give her labels megan wants to talk labels you can give her one you can give her quite a few heartless i mean uh, for real this is a psychopath those are a few labels how about her sister, what she's doing to her sister and her father? How about those labels? How about misusing the race card? How about all of that? You know, there's a few labels that people like her, Jada, Hillary Hayward Thomas, a.k.a. Hillary Baldwin, are known for. And to me, labels, those are the labels that she wants to give other people. She has used, abused, slandered an entire nation, and I keep going on about it. And they're still on that website. And please correct me if I'm wrong, but had they shown up at Prince Philip's memorial, they would have received a prominent place of pride in that service, undeserved. And people would be trying to justify that by saying, uh, oh, well, their family, no, enough is enough because whether they like it or not, the monarchy is an institution which represents us all, you know, the one at Commonwealth and the UK. And it's amazing how people, you know, for example, we have Will Smith who smacked Chris Rock. Everybody was worried about Will Smith. Nobody was worried about Chris Rock. It's like, you know, it's like if somebody smacks you and people are worried about if the guy who smacked you, if his head is hurt instead of the person who received the smack. Can you imagine, for example, with my ex-husband when he was beating me and stuff like that, people being concerned about his well-being? What was he thinking about when he was punching you? Is his hand okay? That's where we are right now. It's like the abusive, the abuser, the bully. Oh, we, people are, the woke people. But only if they're rich and famous. If they're anybody like us, we'll go to jail. Okay, but please let me know what you think. Um, 
What do you think? Do you think Meghan Markle is, this is just a tactic to delay the inevitable, which is that she won't have anybody there? Do you think Oprah will repay her the favor? Serena Williams, Priyanka Chopra. I mean, <laughs> what do you guys think? And yeah, yeah, let's talk labels, Megan. I have quite a few for you. Anyways, thank you for watching, guys.